Hello, hello, and welcome once again, J76NY here, playing Ultimate General Civil War, our Union playthrough. Uh, we are up to the Battle of Nansamon River, and uh, we are hurting, but we're uh, going to go give it our best. So, Second Corps is fleshed out fully. Uh, that last battle was extremely helpful in using uh, someone else's troops, so we didn't lose any of ours, so all the... 2,396 uh, new recruits that we have and go right into uh, our army. Um, don't have to worry about rebuilding anyone. Now that's not a lot to go around. See here, 3rd Division is uh, just a skeleton. 1st isn't much better. So we're going to uh, probably add an infantry brigade of 1,000 to each of these. And then... Uh, do what we can with the guns. We're going to get some guns. Artillery, that is. Okay, so... Let's see. I'm going to go with the 1853 Enfields. Okay, we're just going to create a thousand a brigade of 1,000 each sir, yes, sir. that leaves us with 396 so we can add uh, let's see as many artillery as we can possibly add here yes sir Like we're gonna actually get a full brigade out of them. Wasn't expecting that. All right, I could spend some reputation to get seven thousand more. Uh, actually, not. So never mind. All right, that's about all we can do here. So I'm uh, probably gonna take second core into this battle. Leave first core to uh, rest. Third core, I'm not even going to consider. So, onward to Nansamon River. Okay, General Longstreet is besieging Norfolk, and if we don't stop him, he will soon capture the Union garrison. Our scouts reported that the rebels have built heavy, heavy battery entrenchments to control Nansamon River and prevent our gunboats from supporting the city's defenses. In order to lift the siege of Suffolk, we must destroy these batteries and reopen the river for Union shipping. Three ironclads will support your attack. That's good news. Uh, victory gets us five uh, points, 4,600 uh, new recruits, and $77,000. Uh, lose five there, lose ten. We're going to go for the victory. Everything else isn't really... Uh, isn't really an option because we've got the Siege of Suffolk and then Chancellorsville. So we got to really got to get those uh, cores built back up. <clears throat> okay, so we can bring 14 brigades. How many is going to sit out here? 20. Yeah, we're going with second core here. All right, let's do this. Confederate heavy batteries are well protected behind entrenchments. They can tear apart any Union ship attempting to pass along the section of the river. It's going to be a hard task, but it's mandatory we destroy these batteries. Your infantry should approach with caution because the Confederate armory under Longstreet is a formidable opponent. In about an hour, three ironclads will arrive to support your attack. It is advised to coordinate your assault with the ship's arrival to increase your chance of success. Good luck. Alright. Hmm. Uh, 
Okay. I'm gonna try and keep these guys grouped in uh, these individual uh, formations here. Do a little better job of um, organizing my units. Okay, overview here. Look here. Start the battle. I think I'm going to send out skirmishers, so I'm going to pause here for a second. A scout ahead. All right, wood skirmishers. I'm up here. Ali skirmishers. Just all across our front, we're going to uh, send out skirmishers to do uh, do some scouting. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea. All right, let's see what they can find. Meanwhile, we're going to get these, right? These guys just... Select all of them. Bring them up like that. All right, these three brigades are going to come up here. Sounds like our skirmishers are uh, encountering here, so hold position right here. Minty skirmishers, hold position here. You're fine where you are. Hey. They are moving forces into the uh into the entrenchments. Right now you four here like this. Circle around. Minty skirmishers circle around. Anfield. Come up here. are getting driven back. Alright, you come over here like this. Come up like this. Hey Anderson, I want you to come up here. Or Andrews, sorry. I would help if we got our artillery up there. Uh, we're just going to bring both the artillery over here. Okay. 
Okay, skirmishers aren't really doing much. Not a surprise. Okay, look here. Once those skirmishers break, you're gonna be our front line. You'll, we'll have uh, Burnham stay behind him. You can come around like this. Focus on law. These guys can't come out over here. Eventually, we're going to have to push up here. Alright, got to get these guys on bunched here. Have him push up a little bit. We got three minutes till I believe our uh, gunboats arrive. Okay, those skirmishers are routing. Anderson's moving out of his uh, fortifications. So let's push up. Ross up here is going to have skirmishers to deal with. Here come our gunboats. There we go. We get to pick who they shoot at. Apparently not. Three of these guys. Oh, ha. yeah, the most important ones: supplies and uh, and our general. All right, Kelly, you're gonna move up here. Oil and Canfield skirmishers are gonna deal with these skirmishers here. And I have to move you up into the open here, unfortunately. Really wish I could control who these guys were shooting at. Hey, skirmishers. I have you move up here. Kelly, we're going to bring you up as well. Hey, Minty. We got the artillery there. We got some cavalry here. All right, Canfield skirmishers fire into their flanks. 
I like skirmishers. Look like they're uh, just charging in there. Hey, maybe the uh, approach up the, uh, the riverside isn't such a good idea after all. Law is holding up pretty good here. Okay. Push up. Push up. Push up. Order. Minty, we're going to have you turn. Face down Benning. Order, we're going to have you come over here. Bring you right out into the open. Hit a long street. Okay. Our supplies are still hanging out in the rear. That's not good. are going to move up here. Ross, you're going to go up and deal with the uh, artillery up there. How's our own artillery doing here? Let's move them up a little bit. And Law's got a bunch of divisions or brigades firing right into him. Plus our artillery. He's still holding firm, so. Hey, Woods. You have you come up here, Snow, Mr. Snow, up here. Kelly skirmishes. We're just gonna reattach you. I don't even know where Kelly is. Right there. All right. So how are we doing here? Really isn't losing very much at all. Robertson, Will, move up as well. Well, it's just, he's not, he's going to fight to the last man. Hey, Bruce. Where are you going? Hold, hold, hold. Okay, can't those skirmishers come up?
impounded. It's like Longstreet's moving out. Can't believe the law hasn't broken yet. Okay. Move you up a little bit. Actually, we're gonna charge. Law out. Turn to face Longstreet is blocked. Hit Longstreet here. Minty, I want you to come over here and hit Longstreet. Okay, Canfield, I want you coming down. Oil, you come down as well. Minty down. Alright, hit Long Street from his rear. Everybody hit Long Street. Okay, we gotta push up. Alright, what do we have down here? Kelly. We gotta come back into the action. Snow. Bruce. Alright. Let's move in. Move into position. Start hitting the uh, hitting the artillery that's up in there. Canfield, we're gonna build a line here so they don't come through. Let's focus on artillery now. Our gun battle here. We still got a thousand uh, troops up in there. So Minty, hey, come on, Bruce. You guys all come up. Snow, come up. He's running out of ammo here. Get our supply wagon up. Get our general up. Okay, we're going to bring you down. Alright. Now let's push Kemper out. What is this? Destroy Caskey? Oh, the artillery. Alright. Well, hopefully they can, uh... work on that. Alright, now they're gonna start coming back at us. So we're gonna have to fight a defensive battle now. Man, we're taking a lot of losses. Okay, Bruce, you gotta get up into the action here. Anyone else just kinda hanging out in the back? Let's bring these guys up.
Oh, you can't even get, get there without running straight through everybody. Uh... Alright, keep pushing up. Cross, you're just gonna hold over here. So we're gonna have you do a fall back. You don't get wiped out. Snow. Just gonna move up here. Woods. Minty. A quarter. A come up, take position up here. Take position here. Up. Okay, skirmishers, don't get too uh, too ahead of everybody else. Get Kemper. Victory, Nansamon River. Okay. So. We lost about a third of our troops, and uh, so did they, a little more. Um, we didn't lose any guns, they lost 38, they lost 60 cavalry. We uh, achieved all of our vic victory conditions. The artillery unit was the best of the day. And let's see. Brigadier General Bobby Woods is dead. Ralph Bain is wounded. Uh, captured 128 1842 Springfields. Some hunters, some sawed offs. A uh, bunch of Tyler, Texas, and Harper's Ferries 1855. So that was a good victory. That was a pretty good victory. We'll probably use all of our new recruits to rebuild, but. Uh, it was a pretty good victory. Actually, it's not too bad. Not too bad. Um, going to be doing the 1,200-man uh, brigades. This this one's probably just going to get ignored again. But that'll be for the next episode. Um, I'll probably even just do it off-camera here before I start recording the next episode. So building everything up to 1,000 that's not already there. And uh, actually... I don't have enough to do 1,200. We'll get them up to 1,000 and then see where we can go from there. But I do want to actually uh, do something with this uh, core here. Because we're going to need them. But very limited on what we can do. So if you like the episode, uh, do me a favor. Do the channel a favor. Hit that like button. Um, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Uh, hit the so, yeah. Language can be a hard thing sometimes. Hit the subscribe button and you won't miss out on any of the future battles. Um, and leave your thoughts in the comments below. So that's going to do it for the Battle of Nansamon River. A success for General J and his Union Army. J76NY saying thank you very much for watching and have a good day.